Welcome, or Grezi, as we say in Switzerland. We just arrived at the small village Steg im Töstal. It is the start and the destination of our trek to the next highest point in Switzerland. In this case, the highest point of the canton of Zurich. The village is an amazing starting point for many hikes, as you might notice. Since we want to do a round trip, at the first branch we take a left towards Hulfteck. The path will lead us right up to the third leg of the Zuri Oberland Höhenweg. Our trail today is 16.6 kilometers long and will take about 5 hours and 10 minutes to complete. It is considered T2, so a rather easy hike, but we will still have to climb 720 meters up and down. The best time to do this hike is supposedly between May and October, but given the warm winter we gave it an early try. When you do the hike outside of the summer season, you better bring appropriate footwear and possibly carry spikes. On the way up, it is featuring a few exposed parts, so it might not be possible to go without spikes. On the way up, make sure to turn around every once in a while. The views that will unfold behind you are just amazingly beautiful. Switzerland's hiking paths are marked with a color grading. With the view opening up to our destination, Schnebelhorn on the right, we exit the yellow marked hiking trail and enter the white red white trail. Based on these markings, you can recognize that the following path is considered a mountain trail. It does feature a few exposed locations and we really recommend you have the proper footwear to go here, especially in the winter. So we're currently on the way to Schnebelhorn, the highest point in the canton of Zurich. It's just about 1,300 meters tall. So like the hike we did just a few weeks ago to um, Wildspitz, the highest point in the canton of Zug, that was quite a few hundred meters higher. But like in Zug, we barely had any snow. Today, I'm really doubtful whether we can make it. So yeah, it's not much further, but we'll see.
like if there's one thing that describes Switzerland perfectly, it is like really crazy to be up here. Like I had high doubts whether we could actually make it. And it's actually quite crowded up here. Like some trail runners coming by, people walking the dogs. Like some people just resting at the summit. Switzerland is full of really incredible people. So here we are, number six, the highest point of the canton of Zurich. It's an amazing day, bright sun, wonderful views to the mountains in the distance. It's just beautiful. We've just descended from Schnebelhorn and on this side of the track it looks so much different. Here I would have not been concerned about reaching the summit. Like really easy track, barely any snow. But from the other side <laughs> that looked so much different. I'm still glad we made it and the view from above was just amazing. So let's see how it goes until we reach Steak again. On the way down you will also have the perfect overview over the hike you just did. You can see along the entire ridge line up to Schnebelhorn. The way down on this side also included a few slippery passages. Luckily the path down is also considered a yellow trail, so the biggest danger is probably that you might scrape your knees. It can become very slippery though and we nearly ended up falling a few times.
So despite actually being quite early in the season, we managed to reach the sixth high point of Switzerland, the highest point in the canton of Zurich. Consider subscribing if you don't want to miss out on the other hikes to the highest point of Switzerland. Also, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to press the like button. Thank you so much and we hope to see you again soon.